Hello viewers and welcome to a new episode of the program when I talk to the camera with me Kona Sise. Today the camera Kawaka with you in a new London community for talk to you to manage in this community about how life talent like for the youth them in a new London community. Let me listen to the youth man them as in the share with me stories for youth them in a new London community. Hello and welcome to this interview. Tell me your name and how that you've been at this community. Well, my name is Nayenikao Kamara. I'm here at the youth chairman at this community. This is a New London community. With the, let's say, under the bridge, Congo Cross Bridge. So, as a youth chairman, how long you don't take now this position? And tell me what your experience with the youth in this community. Well, um, I don't take like four years in this position. And my experience as a youth in this community very very challenging as youth or lawyers who serve the tribe who say they push hard for let we all do something for we serve and for develop our community as well who say they try but that upper and that support is not the from anywhere but myself as youth chairman can try my level best for galvanize the youth them do one two community projects and as you can see here in a slum area we get mosquito them boku if you go back of the community, they see what away they run, where they did it to way dot C and all that. So me as the youth chairman, I can organize a cleaning. Last Saturday, for Saturday in the month, we can do the cleaning and for ease the mosquito business and the community. And we can do them with the help of community stakeholders that I think this thing itself can come inside with the one two support if not cook, we cook for we motivate the boys them for another project. So tell me about the thing that we the youth then land at the community. Well, we get so many youths them we we learn so many things. We get we get I mean, carpenters there. We get machinists them. We get electricians them. We get people that we learn so many skills job them fix for fixed style. We get tailors them. We get, we get so many I mean, skilled workers in our way not get job. We just the just the feel from we person also get problem and go we'll call them. So so most of the youths and we learn skill they live now. As as a youth man we don't live with the youth there so as a leader for four years. Somebody go wonder with all and senior where you don't say they learn so yet they not get job. What do you feel to the Ministry of Youth need for do for youth them now then different communities there so we learn skilled jobs but, but yet never for attach themselves to any side. Well, I believe saying that for create a platform where right, you go cap, you go bring them all together and try to attach them or even develop more on the skills. Because I believe say some man not get that more idea of what he did, but if there are programs and way the youth ministry go put together for at least help them let them grow in their in their different skills them then it will be very very much okay for me and also for try for fan way where they self go attach because most of the people have had a table so they get families some they go school and still learn skill and they feel from their skill they support themselves for and they support themselves from their skill support their education you know easy so if you're not get um job we did we did make sustain them you know easy for we here. and me again as the youth chairman you know easy because i do as they say the i do man at the devil workshop so if then i believe if they get team where they do i do let's not go there then they go improve the community thank you thank you uh, thank you name jibila sharif still jibila who are you there and now what do you do for survive I'm at the back of Stadium, New London. I do my stick cook for survival, but for now, it's not really funny. Contact no day, man, then just don't know my community no more, so no more. Right. How long you don't take now where you don't learn this work here? Um, I don't take this work here. Say, for me, I'm four years now, I say this work here, I do so right now. I'm four years this. I say, youth man, how things are like for you? Where you don't learn something, but you see, say, work no day for you. Um, really, it seems difficult. I don't know. It seems difficult because it's a demand every day. But now, we just don't know what's happening. 
so no more sidon. Contact me, come, contact me, go no no WhatsApp for just sidon no more. So, what do you feel say the Ministry of Youth needs for do for youth man in different communities in the salon? Um, they for come together and make something for the youth man and for the will survive because for now, we will be able to come up with come up, so we get small and we get for the support. So we find for the back who know say yes, the youth man and the community and the country will the strain, will suffer. All right. So in what way we want as youth man in this community can do for see that the, the, the community and um, peaceful and not only to be able to bring development inside the community? Uh, the only way pass there for we will help the youth man and for job. If they can come together, let them help the youth man and this community for job. And this community lack of then kind things then the job not in this community, help the youth man then this community. We just sit down no more and watch yourself no more, do clean nets, come on and go sleep. So I don't know the big one do for you. Plenty thank you. Yes ma. My name is Subangura. Right. Tell me who that you be in this particular community and outside this community today. This community is in New London, I'm in the cheerleader of this community. All right. How long you don't take in this community and how long you don't be cheerleader? <laughs> I don't pass 18 years or 20 years in this community. Like I round up me five years now as a cheerleader. All right. As you don't take so long in the community, tell me about them. Um, we experience in the community with challenges with the people they face, especially we get for the, with the youth them in the community. But they're facing many challenges then because we're facing water, road, because the road not make. Then even the youth, the youth then, they work no day. So like we they beg the local NGOs then for help, we follow the youth and get work. As you say, when are facing water problem and the road not good, let me talk about water, especially we now in the dry seasons we day. How una can do for cope for water business? Like people always get the normal pump, people already pay for months, months they use for because they really use people water, because like then can't put Bowser in tank, then they able to supply you with water. So like we. They beg the local NGOs and follow the help for water because like people they constrain the community for water business. Alright. So as as the challenge in the community, how you don't they do for meet with uh, um, government pe people where they represent the community in government offices them like you talk about the honorables and um, the Free Town City Council councillors and the community where they for represent the people. What thing una can do for reach out to them people like so, so that they go come on board and bring help to the community? Which help they only bring come? Because like the council or within the say I know when I'm at Cinda, now I help them bring that Bowser day because like one day we are going to workshop, they say we they count water people and for they pay by five gallon, five one get for one five gallon, but we not see thirty day because like we go to workshop we not see effort thirty day ten that guys sitting they don't throw back for letting help for the community for water business, but some areas in there they get water because like the last meeting we go with the workshop we go people they donate say then they get water but the water not enough, but we for them put a bowser they wouldn't count that one supply. That is the end of the day. All right. When you come inside the New London community, you go observe, say, from the entrance, say, go down, it's very hard for me to see a market structure. So, market place then at this community? We we'll never get market place at this community. All right. So, who side the people can go for go by bye? And how does the woman and the woman then at the community? The woman then they go bye bye. If you go to the market, you can go to the market, you go to the the market, you go bye bye. You go buy food stuff there. Yeah. So like we not get markets in the community. Right. So what thing will be your last word where you left for the Free Town City Council for this challenge just away you don't talk about so and concerning the youth them concerns them within the face, what you go tell the ministry responsible for youth business that salon? We they beg the we they beg city council for let go put up for supply with water in this community in a one. No, we they beg our government for let go put we come we the youths, the youths then at this area for let go able to apply them for work. Because then they, I do as a man on city, as a man on come college, work no day. So we the big papa government, even local NGOs, they would the big day for let go able to apply, apply them for work. Right. Let you thank you. Yes, ma'am. I mean, I mean, I'm John, John Alifona. I'm a community. All right. So what you can do for survive? See me, I'm a senior. How long you don't take in at this community? Yeah? I don't pass over five years now. 
What you go tell me as a youth man, where you doing at this community? How you observe the youth in the community? Well, this one is still for job facility. So we're not doing at the country. So like where you don't land this messy now work here so what do you feel say need for be done for you to man away land the messy now work so that work will go there enough for the youth man there? Like so me the the messy now work me land accompany me the work. Look look facts here that the work. I don't I don't need messy now over 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 five years now. Yes. So for you company you to man them we don't land work but up to date. It's very hard for them for let them forget side for engage. What thing you go tell the one the one they were responsible for youth and the country? I for help them no more for job, job facility. Because it's money the strain at this community for job. Okay. So what else you smile on I can do for bring development kind inside the community? The half of work they want I can do for make development kind inside the community. And apart job they no more job facility. Because if you smile all in this community you work. Still is not in the community better. Then we talk about peace in the community, peace and security. When you talk about security business, we remember the youth them. Um, nowadays we can hear what the youth them can do, the things that they can take and all. So inside this community, you they see such things happen? The youth man they do drugs, drugs business. They are fed with man in the community. All the kush, tramadol, most of the drugs there. So you will affect you in the community. So where that can happen, it can affect the security, business, people and safety in the community. So we'll see if how this community will see. Right. You know, you know, feel say that particular act say where you think he, they in so so for taking and then they it they monitor their own well being and how then they then they then they then they uh, um then the society where they find themselves. Well, this community will see. So what's you go tell you compute youth say now, but for fencing do way for better them and not for engage by them bad bad thing there. What you go tell them? Now you want a job. Plenty, thank you. Plenty. Yes, ma. When I don't listen, as the youth chairman, don't tell me, but still, the way the youth them engage partner the new London community, and the youth they don't talk, but how work business stronger for them. When I also listen at the chair lady, but rest to all what in the youth they also talk, and the message we then send to so the minister we responsible for youth business in the salon. Member say we will bring the program can to them your name na kona say so so we meet back to a new episode of Talk to the Camera. They say tata.